Hello ladies and gents, today I'm going to be opening the 50 TGD packs. Prepare yourself for a day of the most impressive jousting, eye-popping sideshows, and the mightiest combat you ever encountered. Man. So, pretty bad pack, honestly. Again, pretty bad pack. Discard a card and plus one plus one. Mm. Nobody discards cards, so destroy a random minion from each player. That could kill itself, maybe. So far, nothing special. I like that card, it can be good. Why isn't it? So far, nothing really special in these packs. Only like one epic. It's the second one of those. That's the second one of those again. 10 packs in and only like one epic, it's not the best. There's an epic there. Oh, I like using that. It makes a uh, cool crosshair. Why this again? Another one of those.
So, on average, I should be getting two legendaries, because it's uh, one legendary every 20 packs. Why this? What? Oh, that's a good pack. Well, double convert. What? What is going on? I don't know what's going on here. It won't let me actually. First golden. Right here. Um, nothing special though. Why would you? Another golden. Why would you play that though? I don't know. Another one of those. That's our third one, I think. Why this? Got like two of those now. Still no legendary, so. Oh, well, we got the second one of those. This again, it won't let me open or something. Second one of those. See, it won't let me click on any of them. I'm gonna be kinda mad if I don't get any Legendaries. Third one of those. Oh, 
first one of those, I think. Got like four of those. Though. I don't play rope much though. Golden. Other golden. Oh. Still no legendary though. Second on the walls. Mm. Dragon cards. No one to click on me. Still no legendaries. Is it rigged or? Why won't I let me click on it? Oh. Turn this menu to your hand. So that's like. Will that always come back? Looks like it. Why does this have a different text than the, um, Injured Blade Master, or whatever it's called? I don't know why it does that. Maybe you draw a card, reduce its cost by one. Put one of each secret from your deck. There aren't that many good paladin secrets though. Like, I don't know. Second one. How many of these do we have? Like five? More. <sighs> no, let me click on them again. Why is it doing that? Is it lag or is it just so many people are opening? I don't know. Doesn't make any sense, really. Okay. Oh, that's a pretty bad day. Again. They're not even like. Just put it on top of the phone, let's see. I wonder why it does this.
I'm surprised we haven't got a second legendary. We should get two, but can get a little bit of unlucky. How many of those do we have? Our first one of those give you here plus two? I think so. Last pack. Are you kidding me? I don't know why it's doing that. It's really annoying. How many of those? Okay, so let's see what we got. It's not letting me click on anything. There we go. I don't know. So, what is this grand tournament? We have gotten one of one four living roots, which is choose one, deal two damage or summon two one one saplings. Three Darnassus aspirant, which is gain an empty mana crystal, and then when it dies, you lose that mana crystal you gained. And then, uh, Druid of the Saber. So this one you'd want to silence somehow, I guess, because then you wouldn't have the death rattle. Druid of the Saber. Four of those. Choose one. Transform to a, uh, gain charge, or plus one, plus one in stealth. It's a, okay, card, I don't know. Destroy a minion. Add a random minion to your opponent's hand. That could be really bad, giving them a good minion. Um, one sav golden savage combatant inspire give you hero plus two attack this turn so that make your hero power three attack one armor. Uh, uh, three windwalker give a friendly beast plus three health. Three knight of the wild whenever you summon the beast reduce the cost of card bound. So they're trying to do a uh, beast Druid deck, which I don't know. So we got nine brave archers, nine of those. Nine. Well, wow. okay. Four. Oh, and that is when your hero, when your hand is empty, uh, your hero power will do four damage instead of two. Bear trap. After your hero is attacked, summon a three-three bear with taunt. Lock and load. Each time you cast a spell, add a random hunter card to your hand. King's Elk, reveal minion in each deck if yours costs more draw it. Power shot, deal two damage to a minion, and minions next to it. Ram Ranger Wrangler. Battle cry if you have a beast, summon a random beast. So that 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 one's okay. You can get some pretty good like King Crush turn five, if possibly. Bubble Spiders, summon three one one web spinners. So we got three fallen heroes, your hero power does one extra damage. 
effigy when you when a friendly minion dies, summon a random minion with the same cost. Three polymorph boars, transform a minion into a 4-2 boar with charge. That'd be okay to use on like uh something like a one cost minion that has a bad death rattle, like like um uh, zombie chow to turn it into a boar before it dies so it like doesn't restore the health or something. Spell Slinger, add a random spell to each player's hand. That could be bad, like, but we got a golden one, so. Um, Dalaran Aspirin, Inspire, gain one spell damage, skin spell. So that card has quite a few healths. You might only get two spell damage before they use something to remove it. Flame Lance, deal light damage to a minion. Competitive Spirit, when your turn starts, give your minions plus one, plus one. Uh, that's gonna be annoying to go up against, but it's not. Like, the chances that they're not clearing your board if you're playing, like, face, well, Rush Paladin, it's very low. Badokai, re reveal a minion in each deck if yours costs more. Uh, gain plus one durability. Well, that's like. Most paladins don't have many high cost minions, so it's not the best. Seal of Champions, give a minion, plus three attack and divine shield. That's like, um, uh, those, what, Blessing of Might, Blessing of, uh, what's the other one called? Uh, Hand of Protection and Blessing of Might together for one extra mana. Oh, well, you're saving a card in your deck, I guess. Give your Silver Hand recruits plus one attack. Uh, is that permanent, or just when this card's alive? Oh no, it's not a battle cry, so it's just when this card's alive. Murloc Knight, Inspire, Summon, or Murloc. Who's gonna play Murloc Paladin? Um, Tuskar, Jouster, Battle Cry, Reveal a Minion in each deck. If yours costs more, restore 7 health to your hero. Battle Cry, put one of each secret from your deck in battle. So, technically, this could give you what? How many secrets are there? Oh, uh, and then there's Avenge, which I don't have. And so that's one, two, three, four. One, two, three, four, five, six. I could give you six secrets, technically. Huh. I don't know. Not so most of the paladin secrets aren't the best though. Restore five health. Priests have a lot of healing. I don't know if that's the best really. Um, power word glory. Whenever choose a minion, whenever attacks, restore four health to hero. That could be pretty good if you're going against aggro and you put it on a uh, enemy minion, and then uh, it's actually worse for the minion to attack you. Um, convert, put a copy of an enemy minion into your hand. Could be okay. Whenever you draw a card, reduce its cost by one. Huh. That would make stuff cheap, but that's not gonna last. Only has three health, so many things kill that. Uh, whenever a character is healed, gain plus two attack. That's like the, uh, what's it called? No. Light Warden, I think. I don't know. If... I don't know. Oh yeah, that. So, I don't know. I know that, um, the, this card here, uh, what's it called, uh, the Light Warden is removed easier, so I don't know, that might be better to put this out, and then Circle of Healing and hope that they don't have a Fireball or something. Deal 4 damage to each hero, well, I don't know, they might, I don't see that card, but.
wrote, Buccaneer, whenever you have a weapon, a crippled weapon, give it plus one attack. Huh. Well, that's rogue, so that'd be pretty good. Whenever this mini attacks your hero, add the coin to your hand. So that'd be an aggro card. Combo, deal one damage. Pretty basic. Shuffle three ambushes into your deck, and an ambush is... It's an ambush. To your opponent's deck, when drawn, summon a 4 4 in every round. Oh, I guess it's a specific card for this or something. Burglar. This is like Nefarian, but no dragon. <laughs> or whatever. Shady Dealer, if you have a pirate game, plus one, plus one. That's some insane value, considering TTT. It's a uh, three cost, four, four, spare part. So this would be a three cost, five, four, no spare part. Oh. Um, your hero power gives this weapon plus one. Unit. That could be good, but it has some, it has high durability, so it's easy to kill off. Shadow Pan Rider, combo gain, plus three attack. Five, six, oh, that's okay. And new Barak. This is the legendary we got. Um, return this minion to your hand. When it dies, summon a 4 4 Nerubian. So you could, if you top deck this, it's really good because you can just constantly play it. I guess. I don't know, you might want to find a way to reduce the cost or something. But then it reset again, so I don't know. Shaman. Draw two cards, overload two, so four cost, draw two cards. Well, considering that the mage has a three cost, draw two cards, that's mm, not the best. Totem golem, overload plus one. Uh, summon any random totem, so that's hero powers, this, the flame tongue, the vitality, what else? This would be good though, because like when you, if you inspire and put down the totem, does that totem become a 2-2 two, two or a 3-1? Or is it all the ones previously become a 2-2 two, two, and that one's still a 0-2 or a 1-1? One, one? I don't know. Okay, so demon fuse, give your demon, give a demon plus 3 plus 3, give your opponent mana crystal. I don't see that being used. Demon whatever it's called, the other one that gives plus four plus four is better because it combos with uh, the, well, I, I forget what it's called, but I see the other one getting these more still. Uh, whenever you discard a card, gain plus one plus one. Well, there's no discard card decks, but with this I could see it happening, but I don't see it working. Whenever this minion takes damage, also deal that amount of damage to your hero. Huh? Oh, it's cheap, that's why. Isn't that the same as Succubus? Except, don't discard a card. I don't know what they'd put. Yeah, I don't know. Spire, destroy a random minion for each player. Could this kill itself, was my question. I don't know. Warrior. Bolster. Give your... Taunt minions plus two plus two. So they're rushing, they're going for a taunt warrior deck with this weapon and this. Taunt, battle cry, give a minion taunt. If you have a minion with taunt, gain plus one durability. Bash, deal three damage, gain three armor. That'll be okay. Inspire, give your weapon plus one attack. It's fine. Almost be better on a rogue thing though, but. Yes and no, because it replaces it. Never mind. Also damages the minions next to. Why do we get three of these? They're neutral. So we got uh, reveal minion each deck. If your cost more, get plus one plus one. That's insane value. But um, yours has to cost more, so you have to have high cost minions in your deck. So that won't be for aggro, because you don't have any high cost. 
Yeah, but this one, it's like, it does the same thing as Injured Blade Master or whatever, except it's different text. Spire, game plus one attack. That, I can see being used in aggro, like Hunter. Putting that out, hero powering turn two, and just having a 2-2 that gets slower. This I don't see being used, because nobody uses the 1-2 taunt. Uh, Argent Watchman, can't attack, inspire. So, this forces you to use your hero power, though. That's the only problem with it. So, you have to plan on using your hero power if you play this. Inspire, gain plus one health. That's pretty basic. It's the opposite of that. Flame Juggle, or deal one damage to a random enemy. Basic cards. Give a friendly minion plus two attack. This is, um, like, uh, Abusive Surgeon, but it lasts. And it costs one more, though. I don't know. Like, I don't know about Edgar, really. Argent has a charge, divine shield. <laughs> it's okay. Inspire, return this minion town. I don't know why you'd want to play that. Like, I don't... There's probably a way that that will come into use, but I, I don't know how, really. Inspire, gain wind fairy this turn. This again enforces you to use your hero power because 3 cost 3 3 is not a good, like, not good stats. So this is 3 cost and do whatever your hero power is for free. So, like, you could put this out turn 3 and then use hero power as well and gain, like, I don't know plus one health or something. Um, um, stealth, Divine Shield, basic, it's kind of like an assassin card, but not really. Sylvan Inspire, summon a 1-1, one, one, Sylvan. I'm surprised this is an, uh, uh, Paladin only card, but, no. I don't really like the Joe's thing, it's too random. Evil Hacker. Don't see it being used. Don't see. Oh, that could get used. It has a lot of health, so they'd have to either have a big minion or a spell to remove it. Same with this, right? This I can see being used a lot. Restore 4 health to your hero. To each hero. Oh. Well, that's anti aggro card. Because if you're just clearing the board, you wouldn't have done any damage. Inspire with Tor Hope. Restore 2 health. Huh. That's a... Okay card. Twilight Guardian, Battlecry for holding a dragon, gain plus 1 attack and taunt. It's conditional, but it's worth it if you have the dragon. Clockwork Knight, Battlecry give a friendly mech, plus 1, plus 1. See, the difference between this and Joust that I find is this is 100% going to, like, happen. You know what's going to happen. But the Joust, you don't know what's going to happen, so you can't plan ahead in a sense, right? Like, so this, um, you will know if you're getting the plus one attack and a taunt before you play it. But with this, you'll have no idea until you've played it. So it's like trade off. Spire game plus two plus two. That will never catch up in value, but then it will because you'll have uh what's it called? Whatever your hero power does. So like seven cost, six six with the one one if you're paladin or like seven cost. 6-6 six, six with 2 damage to face, it'll catch up that way a little bit. Spire, give your other minions plus 1 plus 1. That will be good on aggro, but it's high cost and low health like this. I'd prefer a 3-4, because it dies to so many spells, like mortar, no, no mortar. Frostbolt and stuff like that so easily. Pit Fighter, basic card. Villain minion age deck if you're caught like this, right? You don't know if it's gonna happen till it happens. 50% chance to attack the wrong enemy. 
I don't know why you play that. There's other big cards. These are both basic. It's a beast. It has a lot of health, which is good. The beasts don't usually have that. Now we're gonna disenchant. Four hundred. There's only one epic that's over. It's 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 uh this one, isn't it? Yeah. Uh, well, let me click it. What? Now let me click it. This the button's gone. If we go like this. Oh, I think it did it just weirdly. Yeah. So I can almost craft a legendary. I don't have many. I'd probably get Dr. Boom, but. So. Thank you for watching. I. Uh, only got one legendary, which is kind of sad, but. I don't know which ones are good anyway, so. Thank you for watching now, and I'll see you next time.